draw place for the BC Lions. Good block by number 68, John Blaine. Opens the way for Keevan Jenkins to get it. Oh, oh. Keevan Jenkins rocked by Sandy Armstrong for the second time in about the last three or four minutes. Sandy's going to need a new paint job on his helmet when this game's over because he has really laid the lumber on some BC Lions today. Watch that. Whoa. <laughs> I mean, Bill, we talked about was this game a hard-hitting game earlier? The fans. So Roy DeWalt fires it up to Keevan Jenkins, and look out for Keevan. He's out of bounds at the three-yard line. Paul Bennett saved the touchdown. Another penalty marker is down, and likely another face mask. Well, when you've got the great field position like Roy DeWalt has, it's pretty easy on your play selection and another penalty half the distance to the goal line and what a way to start the ball game. Major foul, face mask, Hamilton number 27. First down. So you heard Jake Arlen say it was a face mask call against Paul Bennett. Yeah, they split Key Van Jenkins out wide as a wide receiver and use him on a quick screen. Good blocks, a nice break to the outside. Well, face mask at that point doesn't make much right. difference. Ball is right at the one-yard line after the penalty was marked on. DeWalt to Jenkins. Touchdown, D.C. Boy, they made that one look easy, didn't they? We've only played a minute and 51 seconds, and the B.C. Lions have jumped out in front of the Hamilton Ticats six to nothing with Louie to try the point after in just a moment. And speaking with Donnie Matthews just before the game, the head coach of the BC Lions said, I really think that we're in a position right now where we're going to start to thump some people offensively. Pretty nice surge on the left side. Big 68 John Blaine. Key Van cuts back. Has the you know, there's a penalty that should be called more and is not. Calvin Adams actually tripped him. And I wish the officials would throw a flag more often on that because Key Van Jenkins was going to be around him when uh, Adams threw his leg out and no question about it, tripped him. Well, I agree with you. Key Van comes up. And of course, he scored the winning touchdown last week against Montreal. This is Jenkins again. Zambia, he turned him right into the arms of uh, people like Rome Andrews, number 78, and Mike Walker, 61. From Wyoming University, Darnell Flash has given BC the ball at their own 22. This is Key Van Jenkins. <laughs> He's a guy with some pretty slippery feet as well. He gets out over the 35 to the 36. Mark Streeter, number 20, Paul Bennett, 27, and Howard Field, 16, were all in to make the stop. A well, nice blocking up front, 52 Al Wilson. There's John Henry White out in front, number 20. Gets a pretty good chunk of Ben Zambiazzi and Springs Key Van. On first down, this is the drop play to Key Van Jenkins. And Jenkins is inside the 30 at about the 27-yard line. It's another BC Lion first down. On this, their opening sequence, and an impressive one it is. 15 nice. yards the game. Nice job up the middle with Al Wilson to center. Guards Gerald Roper and Glenn Leonard open a huge hole. They've had success tonight on that draw play with Keevan. Now Bruno is saying what's happened to us here. It's pretty good play selection, actually. Again, this is Jenkins. And again, he picks his way, and this time inside the 25 to the 23. Mark Streeter, made the Mark Streeter number 20, and Leo Ezrin, 72, were there to bring him down. You know, we talked... We talked earlier that the BC Lions really had not run the football effectively this year. They should be able to. Their offensive line averages six foot four in height. He will feature them tomorrow night against the Toronto Argonauts in what should be a real headbanger. T. Van Jenkins is zapped by Mike Walker the moment he got the football. Walker, the five-year veteran from Washington State, just didn't give him a chance. That's the second time in the third quarter that Mike Walker has made a big play. Still at the one-yard line. BC trying to increase their lead. Give us to Jenkins again. This time he dives in, but there was a penalty marker on the edge. I didn't notice the movement, but I did notice Key Van Jenkins just slide into the end zone. And so the BC Lions lead it by eight with the convert still to come. Pretty tough to stop them from the one-yard line twice in a row to the wide receivers because of the way the corners play for Saskatchewan. 
Brown comes out to the left. Allen Pitts to the right. There's the pitch to Key Van Jenkins. He's being chased by Goldsmith. Richie Hall comes up to try and help out. But Key Van Jenkins Key managed Van to turn the corner, and I think he's got the first down. That was a heck of a run. He didn't have anybody out in front of him. They didn't pull any linemen. Looked like he was just going to try to block everybody on the line of scrimmage, let Key Van Jenkins start in and then go hard to the outside. I thought Richie Hall had a pretty good angle, but Jenkins... The Lions, graduate of the University of... Stampeders take over at the 45 of Saskatchewan. Key Van Jenkins battles his way to the 38-yard line. That's a pretty tough defense to try to run the football at. But Key Van Jenkins in the three or four carries he's had so far has done a good job. That means up front they're getting a good effort. Second year, he doesn't have that much experience. First and 10 from the 31. Penalty flags. There appeared to be movement on the part of the Stampeders prior to the ball being snapped. Andy McVay goes downfield, but what a hit by Key Van Jenkins on Dave Albright. Albright was coming up to make the tackle, and Key Van Jenkins absolutely flattened him. That was a good block. I mean, you don't expect a guy, Key Van Jenkins, at 195 pounds to drop a guy that's 235, but he sure did it. I know McGee. First down refused. It was Kevin Powell, the veteran offensive lineman, who pulled out of his stance. Here's that hit by Key Van Jenkins. Oh. Well, I'll tell you, when you don't see them coming, and Albright, no way saw Jenkins coming back on it, just level them. Two defense. 130 remaining. Crawford comes out to the left. Out of the backfield, Key Van Jenkins takes the pass for a first down. You notice, Jones has had his most success. Line up this time. Key Van